So first I would like to ask for your permission to use this video for educational purpose and on the internet. That is fine. Excellent, thank you. Now you told me that you, have, you were in lots of pain before the lumbar surgery. Tell me about it. How was your situation before the surgery? Um, I couldn't sit for more than about 20 minutes at a time. So dri that made driving very difficult. Mm -hmm. um, I had sh shooting pain down my legs. Um, I couldn't stand for long periods of time either. You're a nurse, right? Yes. So it, how was your work? How was Miserable. Okay. Absolutely miserable. It was a very struggle to get struggle. through my shift. For how long? For was about it like two years. Two years. And then you are to just manage the pain with narcotic? Yes. For two years? Yes. Okay. And I bet it wasn't easy. Now, the surgery was about five months ago, correct? That's correct. How long did you stay in the hospital? I stayed one night. One night. And then you went home and you told me that uh, you were on narcotic for how long after the surgery? About a week. So one week after the surgery, you were free of narcotic, whereas before the surgery, you were on narcotic for two years. Yes. And you hear all over the news all the bad things that the narcotic do. And for two years, uh, me and my colleagues treated you with narcotic instead of fixing the problem. That's right. So I apologize on my <laughs> colleagues' behalf and on my profession. Now, um, two weeks after surgery, you came back to me and uh, you wanted to go back to work. That's correct. And we gave it another week. One more week. I recommended that maybe wait another week. But you felt like that. Mm -hmm. Yep. I went back to work after three weeks. How did that go for you? Um, the, the first couple times, you know, by the end of my shift, I, I was tired. I was tired. I was so I'm happy. You hold I hold you back for another week, right? <laughs> yes. So how are you now? I I would say that I have no pain in my low back. Okay. Well, the, 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 that's a fantastic result actually, and this is a result that we can repeat. So you are not alone. You are not my only stellar result. It is the way it is now, this way of doing surgery, people get better much faster. But uh, the bones still need a little while to grow back together. With this uh, uh, surgery, because we are not devastating and uh, literally uh, killing all the muscle in the back, people grow more, uh, bone back together within four to six months, rather than within a year or more with open surgery. But still we have to rely uh, on your common sense to avoid excessive activity and I'm sure your body gives you the limits right that's right can you tell me what a specific activity makes sometimes your pain worse um I guess sometimes if I lift something that's heavier than what I should be lifting yeah. I, I do get pain then but as soon as I stop lifting that okay, the pain this stops is, this is your body giving you the signal what to do and what not to do yes okay I think you'll, you, you'll be fine but you know it may take a little more for the healing any other comment? Anything you want to share with the whole world? <laughs> um, it's just I'm really glad that we went ahead and did it. Thank you. I appreciate that. Thank you for the interview.